the Airfix Westland Whirlwind Mark I. Designed in 1935 and first flown in 1938, but too late to have any impact on the Battle of Britain in 1940, the Spitfires and Hurricanes taking the lead roles there. Its Rolls-Royce Peregrine engines proved not powerful enough. There are two decal options and uh, 30 pieces, so a relatively simple build. And uh, a couple of micro motors put in for when it goes into permanent diorama. Airfix also supply a figure, the pilot figure, which you need to paint, and the canopy is clear as a bell. The actual plane in flight, uh, uh, probably 1942 or 43, with the green and grey camouflage scheme. I made the uh, number 137 squadron uh, plane donated by Mr. and Mrs. Ellis of Fiji. They donated the plane to the Royal Air Force, a uh, large contribution of money, and it flew from RAF Matlask in June 1942. Because the whirlwind was proving ineffective against the German fighter aircraft, uh, it was used in a fighter bomber role, and the pilots called them the Rhubarb missions, where they strafed uh, German airfields and positions in France. These Rhubarb missions proved quite dangerous as the planes flew very low over the occupied territories and were shot at with small arms fire as well as all the anti-aircraft guns that the Germans had at their disposal. Many pilots didn't return from these missions and many aircraft were lost, but it caused huge disruption to the German communications.